party. Like, I, I forgot what it was called, but it was like the big party that they do every year. And one year before I went, Puffy was like... Party style, I forgot what it was called, but it was like the big party that they do every year in one year before I went Puffy was like, you know what I'm saying, you moving. Are you successful when you haven't whatever you want? It's like somebody got to brace you. If you don't check yourself, you got to allow yourself to beat you. So it looks like we're getting more juicy details on what's happening. Behind the closed doors of the most elite parties in the show business thrown by music mobile Diddy and I. Snoop who exposes the wild things that the infamous producer is doing when he gets drunk. Apparently Diddy has a history with strong drinks and you won't believe the weird stuff Snoop Dogg had. Witnessed his friend doing sometime they would open the door and right there by the door. Sometimes you see things you don't want to see. Hi everyone and welcome back to Celeb Live channel. So it seemed like Diddy is one step away from losing all his artists because of the recent shocking revelations as snot. Old Dog recently shared with the media all the ways lead to Diddy's bedroom. So if you ever heard about his wild outings, you might have been jealous and wanted to be a part of them. But as it turned out, this is not the safest place to be. And many celebrities avoid Diddy's once famous shenanigans because it's dangerous to be around him when he's drunk. As the rapper claimed, Diddy enjoys giving private tours for special guests. However, as Snoop Dogg has since claimed, Diddy's out of control conduct causes many people to cancel their plans and stay away from his residence for weeks at a time. Music Snoop Dogg has been in the industry for long enough to know the shady secrets and he himself witnessed a lot of weird stuff during never-ending gatherings. And as he stated, there's no room for f Decency once Puffy began drinking, according to the rapper, the music mobile is turning into uncontrollable beast who neglects all rules and is the most unspeakable things with young male artists. There's been a lot of revelations about these parties by many other celebs and the wild stories about how Young male artists are being trapped into the infamous producer's lair to perform special favors for the music mobile in exchange for fame and a couple of albums and it's not the first time when we hear about Diddy's true nature waking up after a few glasses of strong beverages this rapper and him, they all in the room together. It looks like Diddy's love for experimenting and luring rappers into his bedroom with a bunch of toys is not news in the industry and even his former bodyguard has a lot of stories to share according to Gene Dale's contract. He is no longer required to hold any secrets for the hip-hop producer because he has finished finishing his, his Xbox outlandish conduct. Diddy's favorite activity is to lock himself in a room with another man, the full bar, and a bag of toys, and he once had been guarding the door behind which his then-boss was partying hard with another. Rapper, as he recalled that night, I know that for a fact because I was right there. He said, Eugene, watch the door that don't let nobody come through. I said, I'll wash the door. And if I watch the door. And if I watch the door and him and a man ran out naked. And I said, that ain't nobody told me that I saw that myself. But if you think that it was only a one-time thing, it looks like Diddy became less and less cautious with years and more celebs. Walked on him being with men and apparently Snoop Dogg was. One of these people, as he said he was standing right behind the door, where Diddy was playing with another victim of his lust. How long we coming put the dope on at the door? Well, you could think that. Diddy was there with women because of this established image as a womanizer. Well, the truth is that all these kids and girlfriends are nothing more than just a cover, and several celebs saw Puffy's real intimate preferences with their own eyes, and as they say, it's going wild when the music mogul will begin drinking because at this point he stops controlling himself and caring about the noise he's making and then sometimes you would hear a thump or whatever the situation is and stuff like that. This leaves a lot of questions about what can possibly be going on behind the doors of Diddy's bedroom. But as Noop Dog says it's better not to imagine because he had witnessed it once and now tries to forget about the disturbing images of Puffy being with another man. However, many netizens are not surprised. And they say that Diddy doesn't need a glass or two to behave like that as one person commented being drunk is no excuse when a person is drunk. That's the true person they use being drunk as an Excuse, and another user added those demons in Diddy come to the surface when he drinks alcohol and it seems 
Like, despite the multiple accusations, Diddy is not thinking of putting an end to this destructive habits and already become his lifestyle as Snoop Dogg claims Diddy can't imagine a week without a good party. But it seems like people are staying away from the music mogul more and more as a result of his behavior. Other celebrities, like 50 Cent, have made fun of Puffy's drunken antics, but despite Diddy's wealth and influence, it seems like those things aren't enough to entice people to visit his home or even dream about working with him in the past. Other rappers have shared their painful stories of working with Diddy excellence at all. When our own race is enslaving us, if it's about us owning, it can't be about us owning in each other or no more hiding. Behind love, and although Mays only shared the financial details of his contract with Puffy, it seems like there is more to this story and the evidence can be found in the secret drawer of Drid Dewey. Bedroom and I'm not gonna go back and forth with Mace. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going back and forth. There nobody I'm just going to if I'm here. I'm going to speak up for myself. Speak up for myself now. It seems like the news of Diddy's guilty pleasure spread like a wildfire and more artists are now. Trying to find an excuse not to attend his lavish parties or avoid ending up at the rapper Fabulous shared his own story of being chased by Diddy when the infamous producer kept inviting him to that. After party against his will Fab took to his social media and wrote you ever got peer pressured into go into the afters, you really want to go home or back to the room, but you don't want to be the turn down to the turn up later, he confessed to a pretty funny encounter with Diddy who had him partying. Into the next morning and according to Fab, everything eventually started to lead to ending up with Diddy alone, and although Diddy was drunk at that moment he clearly remembered this episode, and he even confronted the rapper about that night making him pretty uncomfortable why won't you party with me fa? Or your birthday man. Um, we party for my birthday before you came to my party. No, but we ain't never really party Diddy is well renowned for his wild partying ways, including making performers sleep on his bed. It makes sense for Fab to want to leave and get home safely, but he was unaware that the music mogul prefers his toy boys to be difficult to get in touch with and complicated, and it appears that he still had hopes of throwing a beautiful private party with Fab Man. I like people that's unpredictable. I, you know, in saying I like different personalities, so I was like, well, it seems like Snoop Dogg has all the reasons to warn other rappers about the possible consequences of partying with Diddy, because once he begins drinking, he's turning into a beast who cannot control his desires and even speak. Did you miss me, though, for real? Because we, I mean, it seemed... Like a thing I miss his birthday party man, but it seems like, despite Snoop Dogg's warnings, that he can easily. I find himself more victims to party until new exposure and that's why many people on the internet are worried about young artists who want to sign a deal with Diddy the Devil as one person commented. You better know and ask yourself, do I want to be in music stuff like this happens in any type of entertainment if you let it happen and another user added they need to stop attending those party. They will regret it and change their lives and not for the better apparently more people need to speak.